welcome to the very first episode of Samara in the City. This is a brand new Let's Play that I've been wanting to do for a while. And it's all about Samara and her life in the city. So, let me tell you a little bit about Samara. And here she is. Okay, I have the game paused. So I can explain a little bit to you guys about Samara. Um, she's the... I've been playing with her the most lately in my game. And here we go. So Samara is 21 years old. Um, she's a San Michuno native. Um, she loves the city life. She's been living there her whole life. She went to college for elementary education, but she dropped out. And right now she's living on her own. She has her own apartment. Um, and she's just trying to enjoy her life, but at the same time, she has many goals. She's a very outgoing person. She likes going out, having fun. And again, she was um, studying to become a teacher and decided that it wasn't the best idea for her. But she did use her experience in college for her current job, which is a daycare worker. She currently works as a teacher's aide at a daycare. And she still loves kids and she thinks it's wonderful as a side job, but that's not her main focus. She also, aside from that job, she has a fashion, makeup, and lifestyle blog. Not a video blog, but an actual blog. She loves to write. She has loved to write ever since she was a kid. And as a teenager, she started a blog online. I'm um, just sharing her opinions and things. And she loves it. It's been growing slowly, but she has her blog. She likes writing. She dreams of writing a book one day um, down the line. And she also just enjoys uh, like social media. Um, she's a little shy sometimes online, but she does enjoy social media. And again, she works at a daycare five days a week. And as a side job, she does the blog. Um, the blog was mostly to express herself, but slowly she started growing and she started making money from it. And that's been great. Um, she loves going to the gym, uh, friends and family, like hanging out. She does not have a significant other at the moment. She's single. And the love of her life is her adorable little puppy, Cookie. Let me show you Cookie. Buncha, plus, oh, wash. Okay, guys. Here is Cookie. She's so adorable. And this is her apartment. Let's see, how do I show you guys her apartment? Her apartment is a mix of nice and simple because she's still making it. I want to pause the game because she almost has to go to work and I want you guys to come with me. She starts work at 7, I think. But again, she works, and but it's not like she's made it yet. You know what I mean? She definitely um, needs to get paid in order to get things. It's not like she's rich. So she has this cute little setup for her living room, TV, you know, some couches. Here's the entrance of her apartment, a little set, set up for Cookie right here. Her kitchen is pretty simple and cute at the same time. Um, it is a, like a, she has a, she has a very small like dining table right here with only two chairs. The kitchen is pretty big for being a one bedroom apartment. Um, you have her bathroom. The bathroom is also a little small. And she's using the bathroom before she goes to work. <laughs> okay, this is her bathroom here. And now we're going into her bedroom. This is Samara's bedroom. It's a little bit colorful and classic at the same time. She loves colors. She's still learning who she is. Like she's, she's 21 years old. And I feel like at that age, she's still she still likes the same things she did as a teenager. Um, so she loves colors. She likes pastels. But she also loves plants. She has plants all throughout her apartment. And let's see how. This is like her little, um, her room is pretty big. Her little work area for blogging and things. Um, she has a wonderful view. That's why she loves the city. She has a wonderful view of the city, and she loves traffic, like hearing loud. Um, like She loves hearing people walking around, traffic, cars. She likes that. She likes being a part of you know her community, and she doesn't like everything to be silent. She has her computer, her tablet, 
um, notebook, headphones. She just loves being creative, and that's her little creative corner. Uh, okay. Over here, she has her mat for the gym and a dumbbell. She loves working out. So she mostly goes to the gym, but she has equipment at home if sometimes she can't make it to the gym. She has a violin. She used to play the violin when she was a little girl, but she's kind of stopped playing it here and there, but she likes it. She sometimes practices that. Here's her makeup. She does love makeup. She loves to dress up and look fancy. She loves makeup and beauty related things. As you see, she has very bright hair. She loves to color her hair all the time. She has had different color hair throughout her entire life, and I feel like she'll continue to do that. She also likes to wear wigs sometimes. This is her closet area, and again, she loves to, she loves col colors, and that's why her hair is very bright, like orange red, and yeah, this is her apartment. Let me give you... This is where she lives in San Michuno. She has a beautiful view of the city. She loves being active. So uh, besides just going to the gym, she also likes to play basketball right here. And she's gonna go to work today and we're gonna go with her. So let's let time go by. I wanted her to hang out with Cookie, but she'll see her after work. She has like uh, this automatic food dispenser for her so she can eat while she's at work. Okay, so Samara's daycare shift is starting now. Care to join her or should Samara go to work alone? Um, I forgot to mention, I got this daycare. You, pro you guys probably know I found it in a YouTube video a while ago. Um, it's a mod um, that you can download a, a daycare, the career, and also like the daycare center, the place. And I love it. Um, I, I love it. It adds so much to my game. And again, I also wanted to mention my game um, I like mods, custom content, but I am not, not everything is custom content. I have a really good mix of like base game items and some mods just because I really started playing Sims 4 2022 and downloading custom content takes so long that if it's my time to play and I have to download, I don't enjoy it because I end up not playing because it takes so long. Like if you want a top and then a skirt, it's two things to download and it ends up taking so long. So like some of her outfits um, are mods. Her skin is a little bit, I'm still experimenting. I'm not an expert. So I don't even know if she looks good or realistic or what. I just know I love the game. But if you guys have any suggestions, let me know down below. But I'm not great at like making Sims. You know what I mean? Because I download some content, like I download some brows, let's say, some shadow, some lipstick. But I, I feel like people have thousands of pieces of mods. I, don't, I haven't been downloading that long. You know what I mean? I'm basically getting into mods. Also for her home, I have only a few like custom content pieces. Everything else is base game. I'm not great at building. I just love the game. So anyway, <laughs> let's go have fun. Let's join her at work. Um, you guys might have seen this before, but again, let's play with Samara in her life. I don't know. I wanted this game, this let's play. I really want it to be natural. I want it. Um, I don't have a specific plan. I just want to see where The Sims takes her. Okay, so we're at work, and this is the place. She's gonna just. This is what she has to do. She works from seven to three. She has to take. The two-hour virtual staff training course. All the kids are stinky, of course. Let's see again. Let me see if I can give you guys a close-up of her. Why is the game paused and she's still moving? Okay, fine. Um, but I really want to see where the game takes Samara. I want her to f possibly fall in love, but I want it to be natural. And yeah, I'm excited for that. Okay, so let's. This is where her daycare is. And um, I feel like the work they go so fast. Let me just have her do her two hour training course. Because sometimes I just let her play with the kids and or take care of them and the day's over. I'm gonna fast forward through that. It's a really pr uh, nice daycare. I love how I found this already made because I'm not too creative with building. Anyway, yes, I'm not great at building. Like I enjoy it, but then I, I'm too indecisive. So 
I'm kind of going to fast forward a little bit through this. Um, she also has to greet five students, greet two co-workers, and have a cup of coffee. Oh my gosh. All the kids are like stinky and waiting outside. I'm going to skip that course for a little bit and help some of them out. Let's help this little boy right here. She's going to introduce herself to him. And I'm going to actually pause the training program because I feel like it takes too long. So Parker is crying, so I'm going to have her go ahead and change his diaper. He's just feeling very uncomfortable for some reason. And most of these kids, it's like their parents drop them off stinky. <laughs> okay, go ahead, clean him up. There you go. Stinky diaper, okay. So let's have her clean this girl too. Why is he still stinky? Let's have her check toddler to see if that would, I don't know. Okay, I think he's not stinky anymore. Just want him to feel better. This little girl, Liana Lewis, also has a dirty diaper. Um, let's see. Let's change her diaper. These kids are so cute. <laughs> and it looks like this one's now wearing pants. Blake. <laughs> let's introduce ourselves to Blake. And let's see. She has introduced herself to only one student, apparently. It's 11.25 in the morning, and she's done work at 3. Why are all these kids still outside? Here's a police officer. I think it looks so cool. Now she's going to try her training course. Oh my gosh. Okay, so she's talking to the kids outside, but I really want her to get her work done. So I'm going to have her do her training course. Of course, there's some old sandwich right here. The stove is um, about to, I don't know, explode. It needs to be repaired. Just a lot of chaos usually at daycare, which I feel like might be very realistic, but usually there's a lot of chaos going on. And what's wrong with her? She's stressed out from a crying toddler. Well, that's your job. She has anxiety right now. Um, let's try and help the toddlers. So she found who was crying, um, this little girl. And she's going to go ahead and try to play dolls with her, Liana, right here. She's so cute. She's almost done her work day, so this, this is going to be the last thing she does before she goes home. But Liana is still pretty upset. Okay, well, she tried. Maybe tomorrow will be a better day for Samara. She can make a better connection with the kids, because I feel like today she had a tough time really connecting with them. And it's time to head home now. Apparently, she only made 22 simoleons. <laughs> okay. But she's back home now. Okay, that, is that a mailbox? That mailbox looks disgusting. Or no, it's um. She's gonna complain to her landlord. Is that a trash um, shoot? Okay, calling her landlord. She, the, the landlord says, since you're a tenant in good standing, I'll take a look. She should take a look no matter what. There you go. Thank you for fixing that. Now let's go home. And she's actually going to take her trash out as soon as she gets home. Or clean up around her house. Come on, let's hang out with Cookie. 
Cookie, where are you? Oh, hi, Cookie. Mommy's home. <laughs> dag, dag. So cute. Oh, oh. Oh, Sharva. <laughs> Starting meal for bed. <laughs> so it's four o'clock, and today is actually it's summer right now. So the weather's pretty warm. So she wants to go out she for a walk be. with Cookie in a little uh, bit. Almost. So first, she's gonna go ahead and take a shower. So she's gonna go ahead and take a shower, um, or take a bath. And then um, she's going to get cleaned up, get dressed, and she'll go for a walk with Cookie because it's a beautiful summer day outside. And here's her friend, hey neighbor, I'm bored. Want to hang out for a bit? We can socialize or do whatever your heart desires. And this is Leo. Hey, beautiful. I'm in the mood. Want to spend some time together? Whoa. So Leo is her friend. They're not romantically involved, but I do hope that they fall in love or something. Um, they're just friends at the moment. Um, so that sounds great, actually. Um, see how that's what I meant. I want it to happen naturally where she falls in love. I don't want to make it happen. I want it to be natural. So let's see. Accept and so that Sims to travel with. I think they should go alone. Annabella Nieves. What the, <laughs> look at her face. Jasmine Lopez is her other friend. And she can, she asked her if she wanted to hang out. But I think she should just go with. Leo, and then she'll give her dog a walk in a little bit. Okay, so here's Leo, and girl, you cannot look like that. Let's pretend that didn't happen, and she's just looking cute, and let's change her outfit. So my outfits, not all of them, boy, summer right now. So I do have like a cute summer dress here with um, I think sandals. Is it sandals? Let's see. Perfect. But, so they're going to hang out, I guess, in her apartment. No, his apartment. Oh, yes, this is his apartment. Okay, yeah, he does live in San Michino, too. I totally forgot about that. Just not in the same complex, I don't think. It says here that they're lovers, hanging out with lovers, but I don't remember them ever being lovers unless unless like somehow when I'm not playing the game in the background <laughs> they got to know each other um but okay I welcome it I think he's cute I could edit him a little bit better make him a little bit I don't know I haven't really edited him I added him to the game a while ago and haven't like played with him much since and they just met each other in the city I think they will make a very cute couple okay let me pause I want to see that See, they are flirting with each other. I did not know they were getting so close yet. This is nice. Do you guys like her dress? It's a cute little, he it's a cute Hello Kitty dress. I got it from The Sims Resource. I, that's where I've been downloading like all of my um, custom content, which again, I don't have a lot of. Her hair's from there too. So this is Leo. Let's see, he is flirting. They're flirting right now. That's cool. I think he's really handsome. So it says hang out with lover. That's so interesting. But I would like for them to go somewhere in the city. Oh, he lives in that building up here. So pretty. Let's see if they'll come somewhere down here. So they're just hanging out a little bit. I think they look so cute. Let's, let me give you guys a close-up of Samara. Let me see. I feel like I have, admit, I have not done that yet. Did I in this video? This is Samara. I think she's really pretty. But again, I'm not an expert. I have some custom content on some, you know, custom items. Like her lips, um, her hair, her eyebrows. And I do think she's pretty. Let me, I'm gonna keep this view. 
I can see her up close. Oh. oh, they're flirting ah. with each other. <laughs> dag, dag. Yes, bye. I'll see you later, Leo. Cool. Time to go home, girl, because we got to walk our dog. Let's end this early because. Cool. Okay, so she's back home and it's kind of late to take a on a walk, but she's still going to try and do it. Um. We're gonna go on a walk, a short walk, because it's a little late, but she feels bad. It's summertime, so it's still warm out, and it's not too dark yet, so I feel like dog deserves a walk. Perfect, okay. My love this, where's she at? Okay, they're walking, and it's a little bit late, but it's actually perfect. Because that way, she didn't have to take Cookie out when it was too hot. Because, you know, summer gets way too hot. Here they are. What a beautiful night in the summer in the city. So she gets to have some exercise and hang out with her beautiful puppy. Um, it was a beautiful day, honestly. Everything was so cool for her first day. I, I guess the first episode. Um, it happened so nice and like natural. Like she went to work, she, she hung out with her crush and her friend Leo, and that that was really cool. And now she's having a walk, getting some exercise in. And I feel like this is so much fun that I, I could make these videos like two hours, but that would be too long. So that might be it for today. I'm gonna take you back home. I'm actually gonna like finish off the day with her. I think she should go home. And get ready for bed. Okay. She's back home. She's going to clean up this plate that she left earlier. Um, she forgot to clean up before she went out. Because Leo called her and surprised her as soon as she arrived home from work. So... So she really forgot to clean up. They didn't really have a chance. Let's have her clean up and also have like a late dinner. Okay, so Cookie is already eating, which is perfect. Yes, Cookie's already eating. So, um, now she's hungry, so let's get her something to eat. So she's making herself some grilled cheese for dinner. She's pretty hungry. And I'm just speeding up through that. She's very hungry, actually. Okay, Samara's eating her dinner. And then I think after dinner, she's going to go ahead and work on her blog just a little bit, update Oopa, everything. Brisham, so she was working on a blog um, yesterday, and she's going to go ahead and continue that same blog right now. Uh -huh. She just loved, I feel like this is her favorite spot in her house, in her apartment, because she gets the beautiful city view. And here's Cookie. Cookie's always near her. And she just has a really awesome view, really nice desk. And she gets to be creative in her own space. She really likes it. She did not get to go to the gym today. The day went by really fast. So maybe tomorrow, instead of hanging out with someone, she'll, um, with her friends or anything like that, she'll go ahead and go to the gym and be a little bit more active. Even though she did get a walk, um, she walked with her dog and everything, but the day just goes by so fast. And with that, I think it's going to be the end of the first video. I don't want this video to be too long. Um, maybe next time again, she'll be a little bit more active or she, maybe she'll get to go on an official date with Leo. So you guys let me know what you think about Samara. Do you guys have any suggestions? Any suggestions, any ideas, let me know. And that's how I'm going to end it. I hope you guys have an awesome rest of your day, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.